Hi there, this is Abhishek and in this video I want to talk about one of the very interesting feature of Twitter R package which is related to the get user to get the Twitter user information as well as if you have multiple users information that you want to get from Twitter you know you can get it with the help of the lookup user so for example most of the time we are uh, fond of or probably from the analytics perspective we want to uh, get the data related to the famous personality. So here in this case, I am here on my Twitter account and uh, having and currently I have opened the Barack Obama's, who was the former U.S. president, as well as uh, Donald Trump, who is the current U.S. president. So basically, if we want to gather some information about uh, maybe on a daily basis, on a weekly basis, how their follower counts are increasing. How many friends they are making you know sort of that information if we want to capture and make a database out of it you know then how we can do that well as i mentioned twitter r package has this interesting feature which is get user function and lookup user in case if you want to look up multiple users so i'll just give you quick examples uh, here which will show you how you will get the data so in one of my previous videos uh, i have already shown you how you can uh, install the library which is twitter r and set up the login account so let me go ahead and run this and set up the account with the twitter all right so here first of all what we are doing with the get user function is to is basically to get just one user information so in case of obama let's get the Barack obama's details so get user Barack. Obama that's the name so that's basically the name over here Barack Obama that's what you need to basically pass right and uh, once you create the object with the name Obama then you have the properties like get description so if I press control enter the description he has entered is that husband president and citizen and if you go and look at here that's what the details that you have now apart from this uh, it has a the function has a list of properties like uh, getting the followers count so if I press control enter that's like 94 million followers count so if you go back quickly check yeah 94.9 million and the same data that we are getting similarly uh, we have the friends count so obama dollar friends count and then finally uh, we have get friends so name of the friends basically so here it will take a couple of seconds and here are some of the friends name related to or that uh, obama is friend with apart from that uh, you have the option of putting the dollar sign and getting like description favorite count follower request count ID a lot of different properties and functions related to the, the user and with the help of these different uh, methods and proper properties you can get the data set created for your interest maybe political uh, these figures or celebrities data that you want to collect you can very easily collect it and uh, uh, you know make a database out of it now the second example that I have for you is basically looking up the two users. So let's say you want to capture uh, in just one go you want to capture five different user or ten different user. Well in, in this case uh, the benefit is is that uh, with the Twitter API there is a restriction on the number of calls that you can make and uh, if you are looking up multiple users at just one go that means you are just making one call and that's why this feature is is beneficial so here in this case we are looking up the information for barack obama and real donald trump which is the uh, twitter handle name for donald trump if we go and look at this and uh, with this we can get both obama and trump information and now if we want to get the name of trump so if you see here obama and trump is one object then so for example i'll just write it again so that you can clearly see it obama and trump 
dollar real Donald Trump. So what it is giving you is basically two uh, different options like Barack Obama and real Donald Trump because we are looking at these two different users. So real Donald Trump dollar and then the, its methods and uh, properties. So in first case what we are getting is the name for Donald Trump. So name of the Donald Trump is Donald J. Trump and uh, then in case of Barack Obama we are getting the screen name. The screen name is Barack Obama. And then finally, uh, the real Donald Trump last status. What was the last status that he posted? Control enter. Well, uh, I think uh, Donald Trump has retweeted uh, his uh, his uh, Ivanka Trump tweet, and which is about I have a long respected Indian, accomplished, and charismatic foreign minister. So that's the tweet he has last posted. And then uh, friends count maybe in case of uh, Donald Trump and I think just 45. So that's how uh, you can really look up the data for multiple users or, or if you want the or if you have a need of looking up the information just for one user that's how you can look it up. So that's mainly all I wanted to talk about but if you want to get a little bit more in detail I will just give you the so here the get user function or the lookup user function will get a return a list of user and a class of user so you can go in in there and basically look at these different properties that is so followers count favorite counts all of that information and uh, if you want to store that and uh, create a data database out of it i think that's that's very interesting thing because mostly uh, those publication houses or news channels they, they really capture this data and uh, use this data as part of the analytics regarding the popularity of a user or a, or a, you know how they are really being perceived in the general public so that's pretty much all i wanted to discuss in this video about how you can get a user details uh, from twitter it's just that uh, one thing to keep in mind that in certain cases you may not get the user detail. It may be the case that user profile is not public. Well, in that case, uh, you will not get the details. But, uh, that generally don't happen in case of a celebrity or a you know uh, or a, a political figure. They generally make the profile public, so you should not have any problem in fetching it. But if a profile is private, you will not be able to access its data. Alright, so that's all for this video and I'll meet you in a new video with a new topic.